the guy is really fun. So he was sitting in the toilet once in the building at the university, and he realized that there are two rolls of toilet paper in the stall. And he asked himself if everybody always takes a pa toilet paper from the smaller roll, by the time the smaller roll finishes, the other roll will be practically full. But if people always take from the bigger roll, then it becomes the smaller roll and they take from the second roll. Eventually, by the time one of them is empty, the other will be practically empty. And he thought of writing a scientific paper that was published in the American Mathematics Journal about this topic specifically. And it's just amazing that he managed to get this published. You know, the bar for publishing in such journals is really high. Here he describes the problem and he does like full mathematical analysis. And eventually he reaches to the conclusion that we expect, which is if most of the people, P in this case two thirds, are big choosers, meaning that they choose the big role, then by the time uh, the, the one role is over, the other only has two toilet papers. Whereas if most of the people uh, choose to, to the smallest role, so here P one third, then uh, the, by the time one role ends, the other will have half of it full. Full analysis is to that, and interestingly enough, in his acknowledgement, he points out the top acknowledgement is to the architects that built the building in such a way that there are two toilet paper rolls because they made him think of the problem. <laughs>